Later in this video. Oh, hi, Adrian. Maybe you'd like to go out for coffee sometime. Definitely, yes, always, yes. Is that my Adrian's with Dupan Chang? Poor Chloe. Face it, ladybug, your nether clear cut this forest of weeds, and I won't stand for bugs in my garden. But you're forgetting one thing, gardener. We always have luck on our side. Lucky charm! A gardening hose? <laughs> Some luck. All you will do is make weeds grow faster. Not really what I had in mind, but I guess this will have to do. What, what are you gonna do about it? Cataclysm! Nice work, kitty cat! You're up, m'lady! No more evil doing for you, little Akuma! Time to de-evilize! Gotcha! Bye-bye, little butterfly! Now, we better get this garden under control! Way ahead of you, miraculous ladybug! Well, uh, I'd better go! I better, yeah, lots of stuff too! Some things I have to... Uh, See ya! See ya! <laughs> Bessie, do you think Cat Noir was acting kind of sus? I mean, I was kind of acting weird too, but make sure you smash that like button so you can help me get to the bottom of whatever's going on. Okay, time to go back to Paris for a little while. Plague claws in. Okay, Adrian, you can do this. Oh, come on. It's not like you've never asked out a girl before. Yeah, Plague, but this is Marinette we're talking about. She and I have been friends forever. I could never forgive myself if I put that friendship in jeopardy. But you'll never know until you try. Yeah, I just feel like she really gets me, and I've spent too much time waiting on Ladybug to change her mind. Right. <laughs> Marinette is like your camembert. Besties, do you think I have a shot with Marinette? Make sure you subscribe with notifications on if you think this is a good idea. Okay, time to go back to Paris and call her. Oh, no, 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 what do I do? I am in full crisis mode. Not to mention all of on a trip with your family right now. You've got us, Marinette. What can we do? Nothing. There's nothing anyone can do. Adrian said he wants to talk. That could mean anything. Well, sis, what if it's something good? What in my very smallest of romantic interactions has led you to believe that this could possibly be something good? Come on, it's not like you guys are dating. If you were, that would probably mean that he was going to break up with you. But what? I just mean that's the kind of thing that people say when they actually want to break up. But you're obviously not going to break up because you're not dating, so it could be something good. OMG! OMG! It's Adrian! Okay, everyone be quiet! Be quiet! Hello, my love! I I mean my guy! I mean my, my friend guy! I mean, hi, Adrian! Hi! Smooth. Marinette! Hey, um, I, I, I was hoping we could talk for a minute. Is this a good time? What time? I mean, yeah, always time for you or, or anyone. I'm full of time. Right. Well, I, I was wondering if maybe you'd like to, um... Whoa! Oh, no, it looks like something crazy is going on downtown. What? Probably an akumatized... I mean, it's, uh, pollution. I was just saying, uh... Uh, Adrian, you better transform. Something big is going on out there. Adrian, I'm so sorry, but I, I have to I go. I have to go. Sorry, but, um, uh, yeah, you you need some space. Zoe and I will get out of your hair. What? That was it? Oh, okay. See you later, Marinette. Bye! Okay, Tiki, they're gone. Tiki! Not you again, Mr. Pigeon. Seriously, I think you might need to start seeing a therapist. There is no greater therapy than spending time with my birds. And soon Paris will be covered in these fine feathered friends of mine. All right, kitty cat, you know the drill. Yep, right behind you, m'lady. <laughs> My birds! Come and get it, little birdie! Come back! Not to be a whistleblower, but your time is up! I'll take that! Cataclysm! Oh, drat. Why do I always fall for that? Seriously! No more evil doing for you, little Akuma! Time to de-evilize! Gotcha! Bye-bye, little butterfly! Whew! Glad that's over with. Uh, Ladybug? Yeah? I know I probably asked you this, like... A thousand times before, but do you think you could ever, maybe, possibly see the two of us together? Cat, I, I, I just need to know. No, I'm, I'm sorry. That's, that's what I thought. Miraculous ladybug! I'll see you soon. I, I'm, I'm sure. 
cat. Don't worry about me, ladybug. I've got nine lives. <laughs> so that's it then. Nothing holding me back. Sure, you're a free agent. Yep, so if I were to see Marinette. Oh, hi, Adrian. Marinette, just the person I was looking for. Oh, you were? I, I mean, you were, because I'm a person and you're good looking. I mean, you're good at looking. Right. <laughs> Listen, I was wondering if maybe you'd like to go out for coffee sometime. I'd like to get coffee with me. With you? No! I, yes! I, I mean, yes! Definitely! Yes! Always yes! But not uh, too much yes! Yes! Okay! G great! How about Cafe Riviere tomorrow afternoon? Yeah, that sounds perfect! Great! I'll see, I'll see you there! Oh, and Marinette, just to be clear, this is a date. I, I, I'm asking you on a date. I know. Okay, good! See you tomorrow! What if this is a huge mistake, Plag? Look, you like the girl, she said yes. Why are you overthinking this? Just drink coffee with your friend and be yourself. You're right, this is Marinette. I, I talk to her all the time. Um, sis, if you don't start breathing, I'm gonna call mom. Seriously, Marinette, you're gonna be late. What if it was a mistake? What if he asked the wrong person? The wrong person, he said your name. It's not like he doesn't know who you are. But what if he didn't mean for it to be a date? What if I'm blowing it out of proportion? You said he specifically clarified that this is a date. Yeah, he did. But what if I blow it? You won't, you've been waiting for this day for years. And besides, Adrian is your friend. He likes you. Yeah, he's a really good guy. And you deserve to be with a really good guy. Thank you guys. Okay, I think I'm ready. Thanks for meeting me here. H have you been to this place before? No, typically if I want something like this, I just go downstairs to my parents' bakery. Oh, uh, uh, of, of course. But it's good. This is a really good cappuccino. Oh, good. Hey, um, I, I, I hope this isn't weird. I, I know we've been friends for a long time. I thought I'd be crazy not to give this a try, though. I'm really glad you did. Uh, is that my Adrikans with Dupan Chang? What, are they on a date? What could she possibly have compared to moi? That's just so, uh, just so. Poor Chloe, you would be a perfect partner for someone like Adrian. Who is this usurper, this interloper on your hallowed ground? She does not deserve it. Let's revisit an old favorite, shall we? But with a twist, Little Miss Antibo. Yes, Shadow Ma. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> Whoa, who is that? OMG, I think it might be an akumatized villain. Not that I know a lot about those, but they attack Paris frequently. Come on, let's hide under the table. Oh, Adrikens, where did you go? She's looking for you. But why? Come out, come out, wherever you are. I've got a lovely pot roast in the oven for you when you get home from work. Huh? Very weird. I better go out there and lead her off the scent. No, I'll go. That way everyone else will be safe. She's after me. No way. Maybe my darling dear snuck out while I wasn't looking. Okay, she's gone. Let's, Let's go hide in the, the bathrooms. bathrooms. Great, Great idea. idea. Still don't think we should be spying on their date. I just want to get a cup of coffee. Totally innocent if we happen to run into them. Oh no, this won't do. I need the streets spotlessly clean for my Adrikans. What? Who is that? No tacky people here, please. Ow, I can't move. Me neither. Chloe, is that you? It's little Miss Antibug to you. Soon to be Antibug Aggress. And don't make me use my anti-charm on you. Oh. What? Who are you? Never mind who just skedaddled before my Prince Charming gets home! Not so fast, Auntie Bug! Kanoir, you seem like a man of taste! Why don't you help me take out the trash? Luca Goufain is not trash, and you are not welcome here! I'll be high mighty for a little bug, but you're a nobody! Not like my Adrikens! I bet you belong to a book club! Chloe? How did I not recognize that voice? Uh, not anymore! Isn't anyone listening today? What is it that you want with Adrian anyway? Oh, nothing! Just his undying love and affection for as long as we both shall live! Kind of a tall order, Chloe. She doesn't even want a miraculous? Chloe as a villain has gone totally rogue! Quiet, you! Hey! Leave him out of this! Look, you mangy cat! I am done with every last one of you! I have become the perfect homemaker for my Adrikins, and I will have order and beauty in Paris for him! Even if he is wasting his time with that obnoxious Dupin Chang girl! Marinette? She's not 
not obnoxious. She's kind and interesting. You can take a page out of her book. Cat. Why, you little rat! Lucky Charm! Pearls? Hey, Antibug! You want to look your best for Adrian, right? Well, no ensemble is complete without a set of pearls. You should know that. Oh, uh, get those here! Antibug, focus on the miraculous! One accessory for another! No! Cataclysm! No more evil doing for you, little Akuma. Time to de evilize Gotcha! Bye-bye, little butterfly. Wow, this is like our third villain today. We need a vacation. No kidding! I'll take these back. Miraculous Ladybug! Thank you both. Looks like Chloe passed out from all the excitement. I'll stay with her till she comes too. Hey, Kat? Yeah? About what I said before, maybe I could see it. See us. Someday. Really? There's a chance? Who knows? Life is long, right? Especially when you've got nine of them. Yeah, absolutely. But listen, I, I do still have feelings for someone, and I do need to sort through those before before anything else. I completely understand. In fact, I better get going. I've got someone waiting. Good luck, kitty cat. You too, ladybug. But then Miss <laughs> Bustier told me that I'd done the whole essay in Mandarin. I totally spaced out. <laughs> no way, I do that all the time. Minus the Mandarin. I don't think I get enough sleep. Oh, oh, hold on, it's my father. Hello, father. Adrian, come home at once. I've had to cancel my meeting in Tokyo and I want to review your recital piece before Yes, father. Listen, Marinette, I gotta head home, but hopefully we could do this again sometime. It's a date. <gasps> Tiki, I just had the craziest dream. No, I think it was a premonition. What are you talking about, Marinette? I think all these magic classes are starting to seep into my subconscious and give me visions in my dreams. So, what did you see? Cat and I switched places. He was Mr. Bug and I was Lady Noir. Looks just like a city of blinding lights